Merry Christmas. Today is December 23, the fourth Wednesday of Advent. Micah 4.8 reads, As for you, tower of the flock, hill of the daughter of Zion, to you it will come, even the former dominion will come, the kingdom of the daughter of Jerusalem. Luke 2, 6 and 7 reads, while they were there, the days were accomplished for her to give birth. And she gave birth to her firstborn son, and she wrapped him in cloths and laid him in a manger, because there was no room for them in the inn. At his birth, we are told that there was no room in the inn. The Greek word for inn is actually guest room. So actually, there was no room in their Bethlehem family's guest room. They had to go elsewhere to have the baby. And so Jesus was born in the tower of the flock just outside the little town of Bethlehem, in which we would call a stable. And in so doing, he fulfilled the prophecy that literally states that the Messiah is to be born in the stable called the tower of the flock. You see, the tower of the flock is where all the sacrificial lambs for the temple were born, according to the writings of the Jewish rabbis in the Talmud. So Jesus was born in the place where the sacrificial lambs for the temple are born. The sacrificial lamb of God was born where all the sacrifices to God are born. This shows how Jesus planned to give us the unconditional love for our salvation and eternal life. Pray with me, please. Dear Lord Jesus, thank you for loving us so much and so unconditionally that you planned for our salvation and then fulfilled everything required for our salvation and life eternal. Thank you for fulfilling all prophecy and doing everything else that is needed to be done to make us have a holy relationship with our Heavenly Father. We love you and pray in your name, dear Lord Jesus. Amen. Merry Christmas.